Well, hello. Hey. Stop clawing at me. Stop it. She had her bath today. Um. Yeah, exactly. So, hello. Um, just a short video. A squirrel ran by and she forgot what she was doing, so there's not a lot of material here. But uh, we'll show, show you what we got before we move on to the next thing for tomorrow. Okay, see you at the end. I already forgot what day it was. Okay. Hi, everybody. Today is Sunday, May 24th, and we got a notification to go to the package concierge. It's working properly today. So we're going to take a little walk with Jasmine down there and see what the day, where the day takes us. We've got some cleaning up to do. I'll show you. Got to take those boxes down to the garage. Those are the two that need to go back to Amazon. Knives, lots of knives. Um, and uh, we've got our twinkle lights to hang today. And apparently somebody wants to see in my drawers. So <laughs> maybe we'll do that too. But, you know, I'm just trying to keep myself busy. And... Uh, Little Miss Princess needs her bath. We got all kinds of things to do today, so I'm not sure how much we're gonna squeeze in for you to join me on, but let's start by going and getting our package. And go from there. Yeah, that sounds good. It's a plan. I guess timing is everything because I was just about to grab her leash and I got yet another notification that a second package has arrived. I'm questioning the the I can't think of the word <laughs> wisdom taking the dog with me if I've got two packages because I don't know how big they're gonna be I'm kind of thinking it's not a good idea to take her just she's a little asshole whenever another dog walks by but uh, we'll take her yeah she likes it You want to go for a walk? Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. See how she is? Got to wait till the door shuts and then she'll come. Every damn time. All right. Okay, let's go. These need to go to the garage too. We got a lot of stuff to take down. We're gonna do that without the dog attached to me though. All right. There's, I don't know if it's my location on this, you know, body of water, but it's always breezy at this apartment. It's very nice. This way. Let's do the wide angle. Let's see more. Oops. I screwed that up. Okay. Hold on. Let's 
see here. Yeah, there we go. Okay. It's a nice and cool breeze. And by cool, I mean like, I don't know, mid 80s. Maybe, I don't know. It feels good though. But it's a humid breeze, of course. These corner ones have really nice patios. There's one down there that has really cool lights out on their patio. I'll have to take you by there at night and show it to you. They're like big globes. All right, I have poop duty. Okay, it's buried, thank you. Of course she had to, you know, be an a-hole toward some dog that was approaching. We're gonna pretend we're just watching a video. That was completely weird. Very weird. I'm getting paranoid. So that was a skinny blonde woman with sunglasses on. And as she saw me, she dodged to the side, put her head down, and pulled her bandana all the way up over the top of her nose. Held both hands to her face, peeked up at me, and then quickly walked past me. Weird. <sighs> I promised I wouldn't talk about a certain person's new girlfriend, but I wonder if she lives here. I was shown a picture of her. I wish I wasn't shown a picture of her. It didn't help matters for me at all. So, anyway, stop thinking about it. Okay. The uh, closest pool to me now is this one at the spa, or the gym. Um, I hadn't really noticed it before. I mean, I'd walk past it, but I never take, took a good look inside there. But it's pretty cool. Um, I'll show you. I haven't gone to the pool yet. Well, we went one time to cook out, but not in the pool. But... Uh, let me show you <clears throat> this one. This would be my local pool now. Oh, and it's open. Oh, there's a couple of people. No, there isn't. Yeah, there's a couple of them. Um, but anyway, that's not the cool part. Come on. The cool part is down on this end. They have a sand... Um, area with the pergola and hammocks. Let's see. Let me get in here so you can see it. See that? So you can hang out on a hammock like you're at a resort. Very cool. Oh, I'm going to trip over the side bunk here. So maybe one of these days now would be a good time because there's nobody there. Um, come on, Jazz. Uh, to come hang out at the pool. Okay, that grass smells very different than all the other grass. Okay. Yeah. That looks, that looks like, you know, you're on vacation.
Oh shit, I didn't bring my keys to get in the room. We gotta go back and get my keys, honey. Damn it. Darn it all day. <sighs> Maybe I'll go back without her because I'm kind of concerned about carrying two boxes with her. Hmm. Well, well, we'll pick this up where we left off when I get back to the spot. Okay, we're here. I was editing a video on the way over. This is our package concierge. They got all these lockers. Like I said, they're not supposed to put packages on the floor, but they do. So you just go to this touch screen. and then they pop open. That doesn't quite pop open. Reopen. Okay. I've got one here. And this one's jammed, apparently. Open. There it goes. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. All right, Danette, you were right. I need a cart. Holy shit. Why did they do this to me? You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. There is no way. I'm going to carry all that. Those assholes. I don't have a dog with me. Holy shit. Bastards. Okay. That's gonna be fun. I only walked about a third of the way home. And then an absolute angel on earth driving by stopped and rolled down her window and said, you need a ride? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yes, please. I'm just going to the gym. Oh, wonderful. I live kind of near there. Kelly. Oh, Kelly's her name. Very sweet girl. Gave me a ride. And uh, I put most of it in the garage and I'll make trips down there to bring it up as we go, but, so, yeah, Danette, that radio flyer wagon ain't sounding so bad now, sorry for, you know, doubting you, <sighs> Whew. um, I did, however, text Jesse, I'll show you that conversation. technically still still your mom for a couple more months kid just remember that and where was my mother's day present anyway we know we know where the loyalties lie okay let me cool off a little I'll say it because she won't. The little bastard never never thought to just take the food off the grill. Hey, so mighty. She was your mom for 10 years. You can't just give her a ride for two minutes? Fucking A. 
No wonder she's happier now. They're all a bunch of dipshits. No, he's not a child. He's 22, so she can say that. At 22, she'd be smart enough to realize you can pull the steak off the grill. 